Ames uses a large language model to summarize emerging information, explain remediation options, and automate the workflows needed to neutralize threats. As a SOC analyst, this is the view that I have of the tsunami of information that comes to me. Fortunately, Ames is helping me. Good morning, Carmen. I've noticed a suspicious incident that needs your attention. What's happening, Ames? Lee in operations downloaded a file from his email that appears malicious. I see new processes starting up and several new files are being created and destroyed. It looks like an attacker is using PowerShell to create services and persistence on the system. Bottom line it for me, so what are we looking at? Based on the Talos threat database, I know that 80% of all ransomware attacks start with PowerShell. Given what's happening on Lee's machine and other devices on the local network, the evidence is mounting up quickly. I can say with 90% confidence that we have a serious ransomware attack underway. Ames, what's my best option to respond to this? I've already restricted access from Lee's computer and network. There are seven other devices where we see suspicious activity. I recommend we set up a honey net to collect additional information regarding these suspicious systems. Let's get Lee and the other impacted users up and running again in a safe way. I've saved a snapshot of the last known good configuration of all the internet facing systems. So we'll get impacted users back online shortly. The internal critical stakeholders have already been updated on the progress. How do we prevent this from happening again? We'll analyze the information we get from the HoneyNet. Review the incident analysis with the SOC team and take any further steps needed. Great. Good work, Ames. <laughs>